Electric scooters and motorized pedicabs along the Embarcadero. This comes just ahead of the San Diego Bay Parade of Lights. CBS 8's Chris Grow live at the Embarcadero now with reaction to these new regulations. It's something I think we're so used to seeing there, Chris. Yeah, and you know what? We've got a group of runners that are right here behind us about to start uh, their group run here in the morning. And, and you got to imagine that they're going to like the fact that it's going to be just a little bit less crowded here on the Embarcadero, on the walkways, on the pedestrian path, no longer having to dodge some of those e-scooters, those e-bikes, or even those pedicabs. Now, as for exactly what's going to be going on, uh, all of those that I just mentioned, they are going to be banned from being here on the Embarcadero. These rules went into effect just yesterday. It was the Port of San Diego that pass these new regulations all in an effort to keep those walkways clear and more safe. Now the way that it is going to work is that pedicab owners, for instance, uh, they're going to be the ones that are going to be regulated. They will now be required to get a license. Each pedicab will then get a sticker. Pedicabs without a motor will have green stickers and will still be allowed in pedestrian zones, but motorized ones will have a yellow sticker. And if they violate any of these rules, they could have that license revoked. If you see a pedicab on the Embarcadero on that walkway with a yellow sticker, there's a way to report that so that the port knows about it and can enforce that violation. And of course, if you use a motorized wheelchair, for instance, that is still going to be allowed. If it's something that you need to get around, that will not violate any type of regulations here on the Embarcadero. Eric Netta.